IM is the combination between business and science. Around 70 to 80 percent of our degree program uh, is focused on technology regarding mathematics, uh, physics, chemistry, stuff like that. But to be able to translate those topics into something you can apply in business, you of course need some management aspects. I think that's where IM really stands out. The Master of Industrial Engineering uh, consists of two years. Uh, there's one year of courses and there's a second year where a student performs a research project at the university and a design project at a company in the neighborhood or somewhere else in the Netherlands or in the world. I just finished my research project. There's a joint research between the UMCG, so the University Medical Center in Groningen and the University of Groningen, where we focus on improving dental implants. It's a replacement of a piece of the jaw for people who are suffering from oral cancer, for example. My research is focused on the material aspect of that, so how we can improve the implants that we use for the patient care. Currently in the lab I'm working on a demonstrator project, so sometimes it's quite hard to difficult how an implant will look like in a patient. So to account for that we are developing clear see-through prototypes. After a design project, then the presentations are done at the university. The student can show what he or she has really learned in the last four to five months in a company. In the design project of IAM, the questions are coming from the companies and the student has to come up with a scientific solution so that they can develop new products in the future. So what I find really fun about IAM is the amount of collaboration which is required. So during all courses and projects you really are encouraged and required to collaborate a lot. You are always in a company together with other people, so you need to be able to communicate with other people. The kind of person you should be in a Master of Industrial Engineering and Management is that you have an overview on what kind of technology is around. And you should have an, uh, an interest in, in general technology. I think you should be quite dedicated to do this study. Uh, it's not an easy study, I would say. And you should be quite open to opinions from others. I think if you possess those things, you should do very well in IEM.